We are at the Saukehatchee Stew in Denmark, South Carolina, at the old Denmark High School. This is my son, Michael Oglesby. And uh, this is his very impressive Native American artifact collection. I'm going to show it to you real quick, and then he's going to do his speech. This is his sign. Michael, the amateur archaeologist. Everyday fun with archaeology. Now, there's some background people talking, but... Hello. How's everyone doing? I would like to ask everyone, do you ever wonder about the ground that you walk on? The people who walked and hunted it before us. We have a curiosity in us to learn and know of these people, to try to understand them and their ways. I'm no professor and I'm no scientist, but I am a hands-on archaeologist and investigator, and I've made a point to try to learn of our ancestors and theirs as well. We're thinking way back, back before money, cars, electricity, and all technologies of today. I mostly can vouch for myself when I found, say I found evidence of early inhabitants of our counties. You have to be able to read the signs, to read the land, and most importantly, the rocks. We're talking a time before iron, steel, and aluminum. A time when your best defense was a spear or bow and arrow or a rock. These things existed and they should not be forgotten. When it was your job every day to find food for your family or tribe, mainly your job was to survive. It was hard then as it is now, but back then you had to make your own clothes, houses, roads, and food. These older people grew smarter and smarter. They came from dwelling in the caves to living in big villages they built with their own two hands. The only way they progressed was through trial and error. I think these people should not be forgotten. The only thing we have left of them are their stone tools and pottery shards. But we should preserve their memory in the places they walked, lived, and hunted. And that's pretty much all it is to it. Well, a couple points. I'm sorry, I was too close. Oh no, I messed up the points oh, on the table. Lord. You got them all on the floor. Well, I, I messed up here too, Mike.